Hi everyone, this video is for the sun sign of Aquarius. This is going to be a tarot love reading. Um, I, I just wanted to say hi to my friend Gif. What's up bro? I hope you're watching. This is for you man. So um, this is going to be a message from the Divine Feminine to the Divine Masculine. Hey Gif, I was wondering um, if you knew if you were the Divine Feminine or the Divine Masculine. Like we both obviously have Divine Femme and Divine Masculine inside of us. But I was wondering if you knew which one you resonated with um, mostly. You'll have to tell me the next time I see you. Um, one second here. Okay. One, two, and... Okay, so um, at this time, the Divine Feminine is definitely walking away from a situation that was um, not serving her, that was not um, uh, emotionally fulfilling to her, that was so um, despairing, if you will, that she's willing to walk into the darkness, that she's willing to walk into what's unknown to her, she is willing to um, face her fears, she is willing to um, take charge of her life, like she is ready to do anything to basically um, return to any other kind of state than the state that she's in presently. She has the um, Eight of Cups. And the, um, you can see her. It's a, it's a, here it's depicted as a, as a male. But like I said, we're working with energies here. Um, and I was speaking on behalf of the Divine Feminine. Um, walking away from the situation. Look at all these cups stacked up. These cups right and then we have the moon and if you look in the background like this home is like it looks like a, a really nice um uh, older style home like the look at it looks like a cathedral type home so this is like something that used to be with this female for a long period of time and it doesn't work anymore so she is walking away from this situation it took her a long time to figure this out Attached to that is the Wheel of Fortune. This could be um, karma playing itself out. Okay, um, and what's in what's in the future for this feminine? Um, she looks like she spent some time in hiding. That she's took she's she's she spent some time um, um, pulling herself in, um, doing what she needs to do. Uh, and she, uh, when she emerges, she is going to have her, um, a wand of passion and her heart and mind in unison with each other. And she's going to press forward in her truth and her victory and her wants and her desires and her passion and her truth full on and full stop. Can't stop her with this card dominion here. Okay. So for the divine masculine, um, let's Hold on a second. So this divine masculine is, um, he's kind of, these two people, first off, I just want to say that these two people are not, um, their energies are not connecting whatsoever. They're not, um, there's not a clear, a singular path of communication. Um, the energies are definitely out of sync with each other. Um, this uh, divine um, masculine is, is presently looking for his truth. He um, he's a little bit turned around, upside down in his head, uh, taking his time, like figuring things out. Um, he recognizes that he has been subject to some um, behavior patterns, perhaps some addictions, um, habitual. Um, you know, pleasure-seeking um, habits that weren't um, suiting him. And so he's trying to remove himself from, from this situation, but he's having a little bit of a hard time. Um, he's just kind of spinning his wheels. Let's pull a card. Let's put some clarity on this devil card. Oh, not those ones. So maybe these um, two energies aren't even um, in a relationship with each other at this time. Maybe they're just um, separate energies within a singular individual. 
maybe um, this divine fe feminine feels that at the time that her this eight of eight of cups is this actual divine masculine and she's walking away because she's had it um because i don't feel any like sort of reconciliation like energy at all um uh, let's see what because it's oh, hold on a second because it, the energy is stopped with this devil card and this dominion card so, uh, and this devil card is at the bottom of the divine masculine and this dominion card is for her. So let's, um, clarify this, um, devil card. Yeah. So this divine masculine, like he recognizes that shit has hit the fan and that things need to change. And so he's like trying to, um, get a new, he's trying to, um, get a new perspective on this situation. Like, you know, he's trying to pull his reins back. Kind of um, readjust his situation, like take take stock of what's going on, take stock of how um, he has influenced certain situations, how he was responsible for certain things, and seeing how to make that different from um, what has happened in the past. Um, so at this time, these energies are just completely separated, and these two people are definitely two in two individuated situations. They're not really um, with each other or for each other at all at this time. So um, I hope that you enjoyed this reading. Take care.